Hey, how's it going YouTube? So today we're addressing an issue in this trailblazer. So if I turn it on, you see it's in park, you see it's in park. I hold my brake, I slide this down, and it still says park. Like I can take this back and forth and back and forth, and it still says park. Now, there are a couple things that can cause this, but there is one very simple uh, answer. So first of all, I'm gonna show you how to get yourself fixed on the side of the road. So if this is the case, you know, when my car first did this, it actually got stuck in drive. So, you know, you can't get it out of drive, it's stuck in drive if you have to back up or anything. So what I did was I pulled my handbrake, which is always a good thing to do. Uh, the car was stuck in drive, turn off the car, and then you climb under it. And we're going to be going right behind this front wheel here. Let me see how good of a view we can get you all. So, right under here, next to your transmission pan, which is this right here, there's this little shift cable. This shift cable should be up on this knob. So if you're in drive, it's going to be pulled back some. So the first thing you want to do is, with your parking brake on, and preferably something around your wheels, push it all the way forward, which will put it in the park position, and then put this, just set it on there. And oh. now when you come back to your car, we'll go ahead and start it. If you were in drive before, when you push that little knob I was talking about toward the front of the car, you'll now be registering in the park position and your shifter will also shift your vehicle. Now, I had this break in a gas station parking lot uh, two or three days ago. I went ahead and put it on and I've only had to reseat it once more and I've put 120 miles on it since then. But it's also a very cheap kit from, I think this was AutoZone. So it's part number 14057 and it comes with these little adapters and a handy dandy instruction set. So according to these, the yellow which I guess is technically like this orange one, is for Ford and the clear is for GM. But the clears were not working. And when I look it up on YouTube, a lot of these are like an orange that they're putting in. So we're gonna try that. So going by the same logic, you take the large one and push it through. Okay. You get the orange one through like so, with the smaller side, goes up like it's lining up there. Then you take this, the orange like little tip, put it in from the back, push it in. And that's what should clip right onto this. And that feels solid. So, totally ignore what the kit says about the clear. You definitely want the orange on this car. And I'll probably make like a review to denote that. But once that's on, go up into the car. But yeah, now all the way down to first and back up, down to first and back up, and we see it's working. So thank you for coming along on this video. Uh, thanks for finding out together that the instructions are definitely not right because this is not a Ford vehicle and it took what they're calling the yellow. But don't forget to like and subscribe and check out my other videos.